Hi, question number six taken from uh, October 2002, Advanced Level Maths HSC S2. The average speed of a bus x kilometers per hour on a certain journey is a continuous random variable x with probability density function given by fx is equal to k over x square for 20 less or equal to x less or equal to 28, 0 otherwise. Show that k is equal to 70 for the first part and second part find e of x for the third part find the probability that x the probability that x is less than e of x hence determine whether the mean is greater or less than the median okay so let's do it now for the first part we need to show that k is equal to 70 so we're going to have to integrate the function that is we can put the k outside integrate 1 over x square <coughs> with respect to x and the probability density function, the total probability should always be 1, okay, for a probability density function. Now, if we integrate this, it's like integrating x to the power of minus 2. So therefore, you're going to end up with 1 minus 1 over x times k, and the limits are 28 and 20, and that's going to be 1. If you don't really understand what I'm what I mean by this so if you do like 1 over x square the integral of that is going to be like uh, integration of x to the power minus 2 and you add 1 you divide by by minus 1 so that's going to become minus 2 plus 1 divided by minus 2 plus 1 and we got minus 1 over minus 1 which is then minus 1 over x all right so I think that's clearer now I don't want to leave you in uh, any kind of um, obscurity out there. Okay, so let's do this. K okay. minus 1 over 28 minus minus 1 over 20 and uh, is equal to 1. So K times if you do that on your calculator you're going to end up with 1 over 70 and that is equal to 1. Therefore K is equal to 70 times 1 and K is 70. So here we are this has been shown for the first part k is equal to 70 for the second part we need to find the mean of x for mean of x um, it's going to be the integral of x fx dx and with the limits a and b so let's do that now therefore e of x is going to be the integral of x times fx dx 70 over x squared dx 28 and then 20 right so if you cross that out you minus 1 you're going to end up with 70 for the integral over 1 over x 20 dx right so where do we go from here now that's uh, 70 integrate integral of 1 over x is ln x and just apply your limits 28 and 20 so you got then 70 into ln 28 minus 70 times ln 20 so you got 70 which is common ln 28 divided by 20 reason I'm dividing is because we have minus and we're dealing with logarithms all right so we have then 70 times ln if you cut that by 4 you're going to get 7 over 5 do this on your calculator you're going to end up with 23.55 something 553 and so on therefore what I can say is that the mean of x is going to be 23 decimal 6 so this is the answer to the second part of the question now for the third part we need to find the probability that x is going to be less than the mean of x okay so that is going to be x being less than 23.6 all right because mean of x was found to be 23.6 so therefore we're going to be integrating with respect to um, 23.6 and the lower limit is zero uh, sorry 20 and therefore we're going to be saying then the integral of 70 over x square 
dx. And if you do that, you're going to get um, integral of 70 over x squared was found to be minus 70 over x early on. And if you do it, I mean, do it on your calculator now. It's just a question of substituting the limits, and you're going to be ending up with 70 over 23.6 minus 70 over um, 20. So um, that's going to give us what? Let me just uh, get my calculator here. So minus here, right? Therefore, I've got 70 over 20 minus 70 over 23.6. So 70 over 20 right, minus 70 over 23.6 is going to give us this much. 0 0.5, double 3, 8, 9, 8, and so on. So this is like 0 0.534 to 3 significant figures. Now, for the fourth part, what we need to do is to determine whether the mean is greater or less than the median. So let's find the median. What is the median anyway? So to find the median, you're going to say m, and the lower limit is 20, and therefore you're going to be integrating 70 over x squared uh, dx, and that's going to be equal to 0 0.5, because the median is 0 0.5 anyway. So if we do it from here, um, we're going to move on with the integral of this. What is the integral of 70 over x squared? We found it to be minus 70 over x. And simply apply the limits. m, and then we have 20. So that's going to be 0 0.5. Therefore, we have got 70 over m minus, minus 70 over 20 is equal to 0 0.5. So 70 over m is like 3 point, 70 over 20 is sort of 3.5 minus minus becomes plus minus this 70 over m and that's going to give us 0 decimal 5. So if you do the algebra, you send this on the other side, this one here, you're going to end up with 70 over m is equal to 3. Therefore, I have uh, 3m is equal to 70 and m is equal to 70 divided by 3 which is 23 decimal 333 and goes on forever so what can we do or what can you what can we observe e of x which is the mean of x was found to be 23.6 so the mean is greater than the median isn't it um, because the mean of x was found to be uh, 23.6 and the median is now 23. So what I can conclude is that the mean is greater than the median. Whether the mean is greater or less than the median. Yeah, this is the median and this is the mean. Mean is greater. Excellent. So here we are for this question.